Chapter 64, 77 Wisdoms of Liberation At one time, the Buddha lived in the Garden of Solitude in the Gion Grove of the Acropolis. One day, the Buddha said to his monks, disciples, if you come now to talk to you about the wisdom of the 77 types of liberation, listen carefully, think carefully, and start speaking. The monks replied, Shirzuan, we will listen carefully to what you say, we will think carefully, and I respectfully ask you to speak for us. The Buddha said, disciples, what is the wisdom of the 77 types of liberation? That is, understanding that the precondition of life will produce the wisdom of old age. Understand that when life is exhausted and does not exist, then old death is also extinguished and does not exist wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of old death will also be produced on the precondition of birth in past lives, and understand that the wisdom of old death will only be destroyed and does not exist when life is exhausted and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of old death will also be produced on the precondition of birth, and understand that the wisdom of old death will be destroyed and not exist when life is exhausted and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that being is a prerequisite will produce the wisdom of birth. Understand that when being is destroyed and does not exist, then birth is also extinguished and does not exist wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of birth will also be produced on the premise of being in past lives, and understand that the wisdom of birth will be destroyed and does not exist when being is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of birth will also be produced only if there is being as a prerequisite, and understand that the wisdom of birth will only be destroyed and does not exist when being is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that taking is a prerequisite gives rise to the wisdom of being. Understand that when take is destroyed and does not exist, then there is is also extinguished, and there is no wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of being will also be produced in past lives only if taking is a prerequisite, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that takes and does not exist, and that being will be destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of being will also be produced on the premise of taking, and understand that the wisdom of being will also be destroyed when taken and does not exist, and that being will be destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that love is a prerequisite for taking produces the wisdom of taking. Understand that when love is extinguished and does not exist, then taking is also extinguished and does not exist wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of taking will also be produced only if love is a prerequisite in past lives, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that take will only be destroyed and does not exist when love is exhausted and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of taking will also be produced on the precondition of love in future lives, and understand that the wisdom of taking will be destroyed and does not exist when love is exhausted and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that receiving is a prerequisite for loving wisdom arises. Understand that when suffered is destroyed and does not exist, then love is also destroyed and does not exist wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of love will also be produced only if received as a prerequisite in past lives, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that love will be destroyed and does not exist when received is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of love will also be produced on the precondition of acceptance in future lives, and understand that the wisdom of love will be destroyed and does not exist when received is exhausted. 
Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried, and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that touching presupposes the wisdom of receiving. Understand that when the touch is destroyed and does not exist, then the receive is also destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of receiving will also be produced only if touch is a prerequisite for past lives, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that only when touch is destroyed and does not exist, and receive will be destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of receiving will also be produced only if touch is a prerequisite for future lives, and understand that the wisdom of acceptance will be destroyed and does not exist when touch is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried, and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that the precondition of the six places will produce the wisdom of touch. Understand that when the six places are destroyed and do not exist, then the touch is also extinguished and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of touch will be produced only if the six places are premised on the six places in the past life, and understand that the wisdom of touch will be destroyed and do not exist when the six places are destroyed and do not exist. Understand that the wisdom of touch will also be produced on the precondition of six places in future lives, and understand that the wisdom of touch will be destroyed and do not exist when the six places are destroyed and do not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried, and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that the precondition of name will produce the wisdom of six places. Understand that when the name is extinguished and does not exist, then the six places are also destroyed and do not exist. Understand that the wisdom of the six places will also be produced in the past life only if the name is the precondition, and understand that the wisdom of the six places will be destroyed and does not exist when the name is destroyed and does not exist in the past life. Understand that the wisdom of the six places will also be produced on the premise of famous color in the future life, and understand that the wisdom of the six places will be destroyed and does not exist when the name is destroyed and does not exist. The wisdom of understanding the method of enlightenment is also the law of annihilation, the law of dissipation, the law of fading, the law of corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the method of dependent origin, does not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the law of dependent origin. Understanding that knowledge is a prerequisite will produce name wisdom. Understand that when knowledge is destroyed and does not exist, then name is also extinguished and wisdom does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of fame will also be produced only if knowledge is a prerequisite in past lives, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that name will disappear and does not exist when knowledge is exhausted and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of fame will also be produced on the precondition of knowledge in future lives, and understand that the wisdom of fame will be destroyed and non-existent when knowledge is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that doing is a prerequisite for knowing produces the wisdom of knowing. Understand that when doing is destroyed and does not exist, then knowledge is also extinguished, and wisdom that does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of knowledge will also be produced only if doing is a prerequisite for doing in past lives, and understand that in past lives it is also wisdom that knowledge will be destroyed and does not exist when doing is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of knowledge will also be produced only if doing is a prerequisite for future lives, and understand that the wisdom of knowledge will be destroyed and does not exist when doing is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, 
and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried, and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Understanding that ignorance presupposes the wisdom of doing. Understand that when ignorance is extinguished and does not exist, then doing is also extinguished and does not exist wisdom. Understand that the wisdom of doing will also be produced on the precondition of ignorance in past lives, and understand that the wisdom of doing will be destroyed and non-existent when confusion is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of doing will also be produced on the precondition of confusion in future lives, and understand that the wisdom of doing will only be destroyed and does not exist when confusion is destroyed and does not exist. Understand that the wisdom of enlightening the method of dependent origin is also the law of annihilation, dissipation law, fading law, corruption, destruction, and disappearance, and even the wisdom of understanding, understanding, and realizing the law of dependent origin will not be attached and worried, and will not cling to and worry about the wisdom of the dependent origin law. Disciples, this is the wisdom of the 77 types of liberation. After the Buddha's teachings, the monks who listened to the teachings all paid homage to the Buddha again praising the immeasurable merits of the Buddha's teachings, and they all practiced according to the Buddha's teachings.